welcome back to another Fact Sheet Friday. And apologies, I am a little late with this one. I uh, hadn't spotted the different release time. And also, I was waiting for Giants to ask a question, answer a question I had sent them. About a bit, we'll get to in a little while. So, we are now a few days away from release of the premium expansion. It's available on the 14th of November for all platforms. If you pick it up before the 13th, you can get it for a euro less. And if you do that, use partner code disturbed because you help me out. So quick reminder, although by now you're probably all watching the previews anyway um, from the higher tier partners than I am. Um, so we get the new map, we get the new crop, so carrots, parsnips, and red beets, or beetroot, as we will be referring to them. New productions and new vehicles and equipment. And we're going to have a look at the last of the fact sheets. We're also going to have a look at the Case IH Farmall Anniversary Pack, which I'm not sure when that's releasing. I actually was holding out recording this bit because that was the question that I asked Giants about when and if it was free or not. So by the time you watch this, you'll probably know. So first fact sheet, we have the Agrio Dino 2. This is a cool looking bit of kit, I think. And it's really nice to have another self-propelled sprayer option. I'm hoping that um, in the preview content that we're seeing this weekend, someone will have done the test with precision farming to see if it's got CSC and spray enabled. Um, as I'm recording this, Argzy is just going live. So if I jump in his stream, I might ask him. Uh, anyway, if not, you should do that or have done that. Anyway, it's the sort of thing that I would like to test, but I'm, I'm rambling. And I should focus. So let's focus. This beastie is £317,000. We do not work in dollars unless we're on an American map. And the map's European. So probably euros. Let's go with euros. Uh, 285 horsepower. It's got a CVT transmission, which means it'll be nice to drive. It'll do 30 miles an hour. And has a working speed of 15 miles an hour, which is pretty nice. And a working with up to 36 meters, which again is pretty good. And it holds six, just over six and a half thousand liters. So it's going to be pretty good for covering big fields, I think. Um, does furt and herbicide, obviously. We then have one that I'm kind of looking forward to, actually. I know we have a lot of planters in the game, but I think this looks pretty good, or cedars. Uh, it's the Farmet Falcon 6 Pro Furt Plus. Um, this looks to me like it's a direct drill looking at the picture because that's drilling into stubble. So that's really cool. Um, 111,000 pounds, 220 horsepower, nine miles an hour work speed, six meter working width, holds 6,000 liters of a combination of seed and fertilizer and plants, standard cedar crops. With the kit that I've just brought on Saxthorpe, I could see this making an appearance. It's a nice looking bit of kit. I like it. And the star of the premium edition, the DeWolf Zikivzi. I suspect it's actually Z-K-I-V-S-E. I doubt that's meant to be said. Someone might correct me. This is a 637,000 euro root crop harvester. So it does the three new crops. It's got 450 horsepower CVT transmission. It holds diesel and def. Uh, Travels at 15 miles an hour, so big map, you might want to stick it on a low loader, working speed of four miles an hour, and does four rows, which is quite nice. The bit that you may have picked up, and if you've been watching the previews, you probably will have picked up. I don't think this has any capacity, which is why there's a Fiat running next to it with a trailer. So, But this is the, the star of the show, and the last of the fact sheets we are getting, so... Really, really excited for this. I'm probably going to go and watch some of the preview content now. If not now, in a bit. I actually have a bunch of videos to try and make this weekend. Um, so, yeah. And as I said, if you grab it before the 13th of November or until the 13th of November, there is a 5% discount. And then let's have a look at the K Case IH Farmall Anniversary Pack. Easy for you to say. And I've got the trailer from Giants stuck in here because I think it was quite a cool trailer. I think it was quite nicely put together and uh, yeah, I, I think it's really good. So annoyingly, my headphones are really loud. Hopefully that's not picking up on the mic. 
So yeah, two new tractors. We've got the old and the new. And the only thing that I'm moderately disappointed about is it looks like the old doesn't have a loader because that old one is really, really like one of my favorite tractors I had in FS19. So as I said, it's the Case AH Farmall Anniversary Pack. It is available for all platforms. And I suspect it's just going to be something that you can download for free. I think I did email Giants and ask them when they sent me this information through and I didn't get an answer. So, yeah. As I said, two new tractors. We're getting the Case AH Farmall 1060 Hydro, which is this guy. And I think it looks awesome. Um, and the Case AH Farmall C-Series. The C-Series, I think, is going to be a really nice yard tractor. You know, if you're running an animal farm, going to be perfect. The Hydro would be great if it had a front loader. And if it's a mod download, a bit like Precision Farming or the things that they did for FarmCon and stuff like that, people will be able to edit it and we can maybe add one. If it's a DLC, it won't because it will be protected. Um, but it's available for all platforms. Not exactly sure when it releases. It'll be soon, if not already. So go grab it. And uh, that's it for today. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, click the like button. Comments, questions, suggestions below. Um, go check out the preview content this weekend. Um, the guys who have got access to it will be working really hard so you guys can see what the premium edition looks like. So go watch it, like their videos, comment on their videos, and I will see you next time.